Hey you all, Carpetbagger here, coming to you live from the north, more specifically, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and I am at Kennywood. This is a theme park that started in the 1880s, one of the oldest theme parks in the country, and it is still operating, and most excitingly of all, I heard there's several dark rides in here that I really wanted to try out, so follow me. Ski lift here in the parking lot does not appear to be currently functioning, and I'm not really even sure where that goes. Just sitting here with Cowboy Joe. Apparently, we are swapping yarns here at Kennywood. Tell me a good yarn, Cowboy. Oh, goodness. All right, let's start out with a dark ride. We have Garfield's Nightmare. Imagine the sort of thing. Garfield has nightmares about. Something I've always wondered. This is Garfield's nightmare. It's like in this old mill building. Yes, yeah, so this is this old mill. It was built in 1901. Wow. Before it was called Garfield's nightmare, it was called the Panama Canal. This is a real wooden boat, and uh, it's actually free floating. There's no track system. It's all these snack foods Mountain Dew, Ruffles, pizza. Oh, there's some Garfield comics. I think this is a food induced nightmare that we are going on. All the junk food in this nightmare. Oh, what's that? Oh my gosh. It's an insane ice cream truck. Tarson chasing poor little Garfield right there. Goes into comic strip mode. Mailman. The favorite snap of the Oh my gosh. Look at that vicious dog monster. Wasn't expecting. <laughs> oh. Spider. Oh my gosh. I don't know why Garfield's eyes are blacked out in these strips. It's kind of creepy. Oh, are we underwater now? There's fish. The goldfish right there. Oh my gosh. That goldfish has eaten Garfield. He's struggling. See his legs and tail. Medical supplies. Hey, oh, we go into the, we go into the, the vet's office, maybe. Oh, it's a giant uh, syringe. Oh, that shoots slightly compressed air. Why do I have this uneasy feeling that I pushed the pizza? Oh, it's a giant, monstrous pizza box. It's moving a little bit. There's Garfield right there being swallowed by pizza. Oh no, there's like a Frankenstein hot dog over there. Does that smell like anything familiar to some vegetables. Tabasco sauce.
Does that smell like anything familiar to you? There's mice cooking. Oh, no, they're cooking cat stew. That's the problem. I guess they're waving goodbye to us, all the wacky characters from this nightmare. Overeating, a long nap, and a nightmare that didn't come true. Oh yeah, and a photo opportunity coming up. Doesn't get any better than that. Oh, that mouse, they're taking our picture. So Garfield's nightmare, what an amazing ride. You know the Garfield theming, it is, it is what it is. But to just be in a wooden boat, in a wooden building, like an old-fashioned tunnel of love. But the boat is really floating on water. There's, there's not, it's not being pulled, it's not on wheels. It's really, really, you know, the, the theming is a little different, but uh, it, it's just very, very classic structure to the ride. Be still my heart. They have a laughing Sal here in the arcade. How are you doing, Sal? <laughs> and enjoy the rest of your day here at the sure who this gentleman is right here. What better way to complete our dark ride experience than with a haunted house dark ride. It's called Ghostwood Estate. And they've got some creepy candles, some spooky wallpaper. Oh, what are we? Some sort of stretch room? Welcome! Welcome! Do come in! I've been waiting Yes, yeah, subtitles. You. Please, gather round so everyone can hear. Please remember to stay seated at all times, and keep your arms and legs inside the car. If the buggy should stop for any reason, please remain seated and wait for my instructions. I would not want to alert the spirits to your location. Thank you for your help. Now please, exit towards the back. All right, we're gonna shoot some ghosts here. Jumped out. This is spooky. Creepy. That is creepy. There's a meal going on, there's a cake. Oh, 
jump scare. Oh, that was creepy. Uh-oh, black light. It's never good. What's this guy doing? Okay, going into the cemetery. Waiting to hop aboard the train here. Some sort of bouncing tugboat. Oh wow, look at that steel mill. There is uh, Thomas the train engine. Kids, uh, kids really like trains for for some reason. We're gonna be two two trains together. It's really easy. We're gonna put our arms at our sides like the wheels. And we're gonna go under the bridge and over the hill. Whoa, you guys are great. Let's keep going. We'll get these flowers in the festival in no time. Our eyes are moving, aren't they? Let's keep going. Check this out. Let's get this guy over here with his cold, expressionless, uncanny valley face. Change of story. Well, now before the judge gets back. Head into the exterminator. This is an indoor roller coaster that simulates what it's like to be a rat that's being exterminated. I think we're headed down into the sewer, maybe? All these industrial controls down here in the queue. Yeah, these are really worn down. Looks like these ride vehicles are some sort of rat. Oh, what is this? It's pretty freaking cool. I almost think of that as like a dark side version of the classic wild mouse ride. All right, this ride is called the Whip. It's a classic ride here at Kennywood. We're gonna hop aboard. All right, my chariot awaits. All right, so you're coming along. All nice and easy here. And then you hit this thing and it freaking flings you like, oh, God. All right, here we go. Ah, that wasn't that bad. Pretty awesome old school fountain here. All right, I think we should cap our night off with a ride on a classic wooden roller coaster, the Thunderbolt.
Oh God, no! Oh God, no! Oh jeez! All right. Oh man. Someone just said this where I was 100 years old. Thunderbolt, that was uh, it's a little intense, but that actually is a really, really good roller coaster. It doesn't knock you around or rattle your brains to death like a lot of wooden roller coasters do, but it's got some really slick drops. Really, a good balance, a good, a good wooden coaster. I complain about wooden coasters all the time; they're too rough. But Thunderbolt gets Carpetbagger thumbs up, and that was Kennywood. Kennywood is an amazing park. This is one of my new favorite amusement parks. Uh, the uh, the dark rides, the old old school wooden boat dark ride, Garfield, and uh, they have a, the haunted castle. Pure pure fun, pure goodness here. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. Please um, uh, check down in the description to see other places I have been. Uh, make suggestions on where I should go next. And um, if uh, you'd like help support the channel, consider buying a T-shirt. Consider donating to Patreon. But for now. This one's in the bag. Some aliens hiding in the bushes eating popcorn for some reason.